Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm here with October's Barbella box, which actually seemed to come at a decent time in the month uh, this time. So I was able to open it during the daytime. So there's actually going to be light for this video. To go back to last month, um, just to review, we got the the joggers, the blue joggers, and some other random stuff. The number one thing that's been like super cool about last month's box is we got that muscle soak, and that was just in time for the CrossFit Open, and that has been a lifesaver. That stuff is great. It's minty. It feels awesome. Hope everyone's having a good open. If you are a CrossFitter, how did 20.2 go? Because I ripped my hand wide open, and it was excellent. I would definitely say that 20.2's workout was way more fun than 20.1's workout, which was awful. I actually really enjoyed 20.2 until I ripped about 18 minutes into the workout and then didn't even realize that I had ripped until there was blood on my jump rope and on my bar or my dumbbells and on my pull-up bar. So that was just excellent. But we are all set with some hydro band-aids and it is healing right up. Well, let's go ahead and open October's box. So I've already cut the seal on it here. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it up. And we did know from the spoilers that we were getting the Lioness open back um, t-shirt. And of course we've got our breakdown of everything that's in here. So like I mentioned, we have the Femroyal Lioness open back top. We have a pair of exo sleeve protect sleeves um, for your shins. And then we have a vitamin C serum, three energy packets, and some high protein coffee. Oh, that sounds fun. And a rep counter, so a rep cord. So let's take a look. Here's the shirt that we got. I I honestly didn't even go in and edit my size, so I was surprised when I opened this to find that I got a small. I forgot. Um, so let's see. I'm glad I got a small. I was looking at some of people's posts and the medium was gonna be a little bit too big for me. So we got the t-shirt here and I will do a try on before this video is over. This cute shirt and it's really cute in the back. It's a nice open back. I can't work out in long sleeves, so this would be really good on the way to the gym with like a cute sports bra um, or also going to like yoga if you're going to end up taking your shirt off anyway. We got the black exo sleeves, so your shin sleeves, and these are good for rope climbs and box jumps, and they match the exo sleeves that were in the the summer's box the light knee sleeves which i use a lot more than i thought i would hopefully these don't come apart like those do i know some people were having some issues with this logo part here unraveling and falling right off so hopefully these are a better quality i don't know if i'm going to use them as much as i use the other ones though i I tend to like stick away from box jumps and do step ups because I've ripped my shins open one too many times and it's just not worth it for me. But I'll try those out for deadlifts. My husband needs these. He actually rips up his shins all the time deadlifting. Vitamin C serum. I'm not even really sure what to use this for. Maybe it's a skin thing. I'll have to take a look on the card. But it's Flour Mill is the brand. It's not even, it's not even focusing. Why am I doing that? Let's see what it says. It says signature serum created to restore skin's balance, texture, and natural radiance. It's a multifaceted facial oil compromised of nutrient dense ingredients designed to deliver free radical fighting antioxidants, nourishing fatty acids, and balancing minerals to rejuvenate, repair, and tone, and protect your skin. $75 value. Okay. So that's a really expensive serum. I would never pay for that much outside of getting it in a subscription box. So I will give it a try and see how I like it. And then never repurchase it because I'm not buying it for $70. And then here we got some True Labs Energy. My guess is it's like a pre-workout. 
I got orange pineapple, orange pineapple, blackberry lemonade, and blueberry pomegranate. This stuff is the True Labs Three Energy Packs is a three dollar value, so a dollar each. Signature formula containing adenine, ribose, phos and phosphates to help body create energy at a cellular level. It's it's fancy pre workout. I'll use it anyway. And we also have this high protein coffee, which is a mocha iced coffee. And it looks like you just add water with this in a blender bottle. And then it's, I'm, I'd be down for this. I'd drink this in the morning. And then we have a rep counter. So you can count how many rounds you got done of something. That's kind of cool. These are cute. We use poker chips in my gym, so nothing fancy. I, I'm probably going to lose this. I'm not going to lie. I'll probably lose it in the depths of my backpack. But it's cute, and it's a really good intention. As always, we have random coupon cards here and codes. Let's see what we got. I'm not really sure what this one is. This looks like it's some sort of programming breakdown from ironroyal.com and girlsgonerx.com. So it looks like it's a lifting programming as well as some conditioning programming, like a says the lift up series. I'm not 100% sure, but it looks like some sort of rep scheme for programming. We also have here a, oh, this is for the protein coffee. It's a discount code for 15% off with the code Barbella and it's valid through November. This is a registration code for a competition, it looks like, with registration being $20 and you can use a promo code to get a free entry. We've got this pre-workout, the True Labs pre-workout stuff um, with a discount code and also a Green Chef $5 meal card. So for meals that you can make at home. I have Home Chef personally, so I'm not going to use that Green Chef. So if anybody wants that, send me a message and you can have it. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and try on this top before we talk about November's spoiler. Okay, so here is the Lioness shirt. This is a size small, and I'm glad that that's the size that came, even though I didn't double check because that's what fits correctly. We got a cute open back here. I don't have a cute bra on, but you get the point. I'm a lot happier with this than I actually thought I would. And here's the tag. <laughs> it's very cute. So November's spoiler that has been up on Barbella's Instagram is this crop crisscrossy bra. It's more of like a light coverage bra from the same brand that a pink tank top came from a few months back. It's really cute. It's very light duty though. Like if you've got like big girls, it's probably not going to hold it down real well. It's probably more of a, like a warm rod, like stretching bra, something that you'd wear to yoga or more like a gentle Pilates class. I'm not going to be like throwing a bar while wearing it. Um, but it's very cute. It's, it's a weird cut. It kind of ends like right here. I will insert a picture of the bra. I'm going to keep subscribed to it for the bra because I want to try it on. I want to see how cute it is. I'll end up wearing it to yoga or something like that. A lot of people are opting out of November's box because that bra isn't their style or something that they would wear. I've read a lot of complaints in the Barbella Facebook group about the bra for next month because it's too light of a coverage and they don't really send a lot of bras for big chested girls. Unfortunately, I think that that's kind of like a minority thing for the big chested ladies out there. The medium coverage seems to work pretty well for most people and that's probably why that's what they usually send. I'm down for it. I'm down for it to wear to yoga or something lighter than that, but that's just my personal preference. Coming up for the holidays, I'd like to see some holiday themed print something. Personally, I love like 
the sweater patterns and stuff like that. Some of the companies have had like booty shorts with sweater patterns on them and I would love to see something like that coming up. I'm a person that always ends up working out in shorts no matter the weather. So I would be super down for some cute midwinter booty shorts, but that's just me. I want to give it up to Barbella for actually getting the boxes out early this month. So thank you. That was a huge bonus this month to be able to open it in the middle of the month instead of at the very end. So thank you, Barbella shipping team. I appreciate you. That's all I have for you guys today. So thank you so much for opening this with me. And I hope to see you next time. Again, if you like these unboxings for this Barbella box, as well as like skincare or anything like that, I think I'm going to do some tutorials on some nail art as well soon. Hit subscribe and I'll see you guys later. Bye.